Hey, how's it going everyone? Relax the Wolf here. Welcome back. So, before we uh, continue this episode, I just want to show you a little trick. Uh, if you press L1 and R1, you're going to open this menu, the stance menu. Uh, we just saved on the previous episode uh, at the end of that, so we're, we're, we're going to go to the main menu. Uh, I'm going to show you a trick in this game. So, if you, ca uh, if you come here... And you go to edit save data. So back in the day, there were uh, there were memory cards, right? So this is what a memory card storage look looks like. Uh, and in this game, they allow you to like go to an empty space, press circle, add virtual save data, and uh, you can add any game, any Konami game from here. Just add a couple, just for the heck of it. Uh, and uh, they're gonna like Psycho Mantis is gonna like talk about it because you know uh, this game was gr like was great, still great because they br you know there's a lot of break in the fourth wall. So I, I just added Silent Hill, you know Castlevania Symphony of the Night, uh, and and you know two more just to, for the for the upcoming let's say s sequence upcoming. Cutscene? I'm coming. I don't know. Just add a couple of uh, a couple of uh, Konami games, or a couple, you know, one or two from these games, and then we're gonna go back into the game. We're gonna load our save. Cause I was just messing around in the menus and reading like the online manual and, and all of that, and I saw that and I was like, that's uh, that's neat, cause you know this game. Um, Back in the day, kind of had yeah. We've, okay, we've, let's go. We've seen this I know already. this place better than you. I'll be point man. Yeah, I just wanted Follow to add me. a couple of uh, other Konami games uh, on the memory card on the virtual That's memory card. There's no guard. What happened to the music? I'll keep a lookout. I can't Make skip sure this. Make sure you're ready, uh, okay? Yeah, we're gonna go back and grab the things that we grabbed because. Uh, Yeah, just make sure to do it, you know, for for a treat. You're gonna get a treat when you do it, sort of. Cause man, I remember back in the day. If you know, you know. But it's just, it's just great, man. We got the the goggles, right? Yeah, night vision goggles. Okay, let's continue now. Probably not to spoil things, but probably the people watching this, if they watch this. What happened? They already know the game. I'm but hey. Fine. I like it this way. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, Mr. Foxhound. The commander is waiting. <laughs> Just messing with it. I don't know what triggers. Yeah, also, if you look at her for. Oh, right. If you look through her eyes. But if he, uh, before you come in here, if you look at her for long, she'll she'll blush. She's gonna get redder and redder. She's gonna just be more red in the face. All right, we triggered it. I think it's a time thing. Snake. Oh, 
Answer the call. Snake, Meryl's not herself. Don't use your weapon. It's Psycho Mantis. He's controlling Meryl. That tune is his mind control music. Don't use your weapon. Try to knock her out. Okay, what we're gonna do is use a stun grenade. That's how I've always used it. You can knock her out by choking her a little bit. Or attacking her, but I don't want to do that. I want to stun her. Imagine playing this back in the day on PS1. It's like you enjoy How do you know? How did you know? So the game would read your memory card? So the trick you is don't believe me? I will show you my psychokinetic power. Put your controller on the floor. Put it down as bright as you can. That's good. Now I will move your controller by the power of my will alone. So you put it down and it's shaking right now, rumbling and shaking, and it's moving. So breaking the fourth wall, I mean back in the day when I played this I was like, what the actual demonstration. It's a it's a it's a neat trick. Uh so um idiot. <laughs> okay, so it would read your memory card and look for Konami games. If you have any Konami games saved up or you played them, it would read them and, and say them to you. So basically this fight, right now he can read our mind. And let me let me have uh, that. So we can't attack him yet. We can't we can't do it. But if we do this, L1 and R1 controller setting, and then uh, connect as player two, because that's the trick. You need to unplug your controller and put it in player two slot. And now he can't read your mind. So you press L1 and R1 in this game, or the home button, and then back up or back out. And uh, you can have this stance menu, but L1 and R1, I just kept pressing buttons <laughs> until I found it. Because it, it has to, you know, you have to have that. Because without connecting as player two, you can't beat him. I don't think it's possible to beat him without connecting to player two. So we are connected to player two. And we're going to fight him now. We can attack him. I need to 
be careful. I don't want to die. Let me use Famas. Man, I don't want to use the, the, the thermal goggles because it's just, I mean you have to because he's invisible, sort of, but you don't really have to, you can see a little bit, I think. So this is a uh, sort of like a gimmick fight when you know what you're doing because you know when you fight him and he, you can't attack him I remember oh my god I was like what to do we didn't have the internet or anything like that so you need to figure it out or know somebody that has that knows they were like magazines and stuff I want to attack him. I want to punch him for the final. Yeah, I should have removed the uh, thermal goggle, but it's okay. I want to see him without that. <laughs> Dying without that. Colonel, your niece is going to be okay. Thanks, Snake. I owe you one. Now that Mantis is beaten, Meryl's brainwashing should wear off, right, Naomi? Yes. But why did you go so far out of your way to save her? For Campbell's sake, or maybe it's because you like her? I don't want to see anyone die right in front of me. Oh, really? Since when did anybody's death bother you so much? Naomi, it's true that Snake has killed a lot of people. But that doesn't mean he doesn't have a heart. It's okay, Colonel. She's right. Shut up, Naomi. So, you used the other... I, I wasn't able to read the future. A strong man doesn't need to read the future. He makes, he makes his, his own. own. I remember that quote. Perhaps so. But I will read your future. <laughs> to get to Metal Gear's underground maintenance base. You have to go through that hidden door. There's a hidden door behind the bookcase. The overland route. It's blocked by frozen glaciers. Go past the communication towers. And use the tower's walkway. I just love it when you defeat a boss in Metal this? Gear. They just become people's minds. helpful. And they tell you what to do. In my lifetime... I have read the past, presents, and futures of thousands upon thousands of men and women. 
Oh, gross. And each mind that I peered into was stuffed with the same single object of obsession. That selfish and atavistic desire to pass on one seed. It was enough to make me sick. Every living thing on this planet exists to mindlessly pass it's on that repopulation. DNA. To repopulate, that <laughs> sir. And that's why there is war. But you, you are different. You're the same as us. We have no past, no future. We live in the moment. That's our only purpose. Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment. We're thrown into this world. We're fated to bring each other nothing but pain and misery. The first person whose mind I dove into was my father's. I saw nothing but disgust and hatred for me in his heart. My mother died in childbirth. And he despised me for it. I thought my father was going to kill me. That's when my future disappeared. I lost my past as well. When I came to, the village was engulfed in flames. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see that you have suffered the same trauma. <laughs> We are truly the same, you and I. The world is a more interesting place with people like you in it. Ah, thank you. I never agreed with the boss's revolution. His dreams of world conquest do not interest me. I just wanted an excuse to kill as many people as I could. You monster. Let him talk. He doesn't have much time left. I've seen through evil. You, Snake. You're just like the boss. No, you're worse. Compared to you, I'm not so bad. I read her mind as well. Meryl's? I saw you there. You have a large place in your heart. A large place? Yes, a large place. But I do not know if your futures lie together. I have a last request. What is it? My mask. Put it back on. Okay. Like this. Other people's thoughts force their way into my mind before I die. I want to be by myself. I want to be left alone in my own world. I'll open the door for you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. Now, too late, you real, uh, realize that just now. But thank you, Mr. Psycho Man. Let's go, Meryl. I'm sorry. Meryl? How could I let Mantis control my mind like that? If you're gonna doubt yourself, I'll leave you here. You're right. Never doubt yourself. Just let it make you stronger. Learn something from it. You're right. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Snake, can I ask you something? What? About what Mantis said. 
I was just wondering. What? What's the problem now? Oh, no, nothing. So, tell me, Snake. What's your name? Your real name? A name means nothing on the battlefield. How old are you? Old enough to know what death looks like. Any family? No, but I was raised by many people. Is there anyone you like? I've never been interested in anyone else's life. So you are all alone. Just like Mantis said. Other people just complicate my life. I don't like to get involved. You're a sad, lonely man. Come on. Let's go. You're old enough to know what death looks like. Alright. Okay, plugs like the controller back. Okay, we're done with uh, Psychomantis. There he is. Uh, let's continue. We need that ration and all of that. I think. Nah. I was wondering, should I go back Did now or advance? Because we have to wolf, backtrack. Half husky. How do you know so much? I ride dog sleds. I'm a musher. I'll take point. Snake, you follow me. It's too dark, so also if you look through this hall, Meryl's there, so we need to go there, but I need to grab some stuff first. I, th I remember there are loot that we're going to need, and there are huskies and... What not? They're gonna attack you, so it's better to punch before they do. Just a little punch. It's not gonna hurt. They're tough. They're my cousins, but it's fine. I'm sorry. No. I said no. There's a little space that you can crawl into here. And let me see how many do we have? Three. Mm -mm. Is it enough? We'll see. But anyway, the dogs are half Snake, dog, half what's wrong? wolf. I thought you were good with dogs. Love uh, Meryl. If you look at her for a little bit, she'll blush. What? What is it? You can see her color change. Anyway, um, let's continue. Because there, there were a lot of, you know, the cutscenes are long, and I really want to cram as much play through or gameplay as I can into one episode. This place is mine. I'll take point again. Stay back, okay? But the radar isn't working. And since we can't use the mine detector either... Leave it to me! So basically she knows where the mines are? Honestly, I used to think she took unnecessary steps. Like, you're gonna see why, but she took unnecessary steps. So, what do you think? Pretty good, huh? How did you know where the mines were? 
It sounds weird, but when Mantis dove into my mind, I was able to see where the mines were placed. Are you impressed? Well, a little bit. Only a little? Because look at the look at the footsteps. Look, she could have just walked straight from there. <laughs> I used to think that. Uh, I'm gonna take the mines though. If you crawl, if you crawl, you can pick them up. They won't. Uh, they wouldn't detonate. strength. I was a fool. I wanted to be a soldier. But war is ugly. There's nothing glamorous about it. Snake, please save yourself. Go on living and don't give up on people. Don't forget me. Yeah, Meryl, uh, I got a call. I need to pick this up. Just hang in there for a bit. Meryl! Damn. Snake, it's a trap. The sniper's trick to lure you out. The sniper's waiting for you to go and help Meryl, so he can pick you off. Don't do it. Must be Sniper Wolf, Foxhound's best shooter. A distant cousin. Snipers usually work in pairs, but this one's alone, huh? I know her. She can wait for hours, days, or weeks. It doesn't matter to her. She's just watching and waiting for you to expose yourself. Maybe so, but Meryl can't hold out that long. Snake, can you see Wolf from where you are? There's nowhere to hide between here and the tower. She must be on the second floor of the tower. If Wolf is in the communications tower, she can see you perfectly. It's the classic sniper's position. At that distance, you won't be able to hit her with a standard weapon either. You'll need a sniper rifle. Colonel, take it easy. <sighs> I'm gonna save Meryl, no matter what it takes. Okay. Thanks. What's wrong, Naomi? Nothing. I'm just surprised you're willing to sacrifice yourself. You got the genes of a soldier, not a savior. You trying to say that I'm only interested in saving my own skin? I wouldn't go that far, but... I don't know what the hell my genes look like, and I don't care. I operate on instinct. Like an animal? I'm going to save Meryl. I don't need an excuse. Okay. And I'm not doing it for someone else, either. I'm gonna save Meryl for myself. Colonel, don't worry. Snake, thanks. I understand. I'm sorry. Um, we can't fight her now. Uh, we need to get the sniper rifle, but let me try to remember, uh, Otacon's, uh, frequency. Is it this? Sniper rifle anywhere on this base. A sniper rifle? Meryl's been shot. 
by an extremely good sniper. Sniper? A high-quality sniper rifle is the only way I can fight back. I, uh, I saw a PSG-1 in the armory in the second floor basement of the tank hangar. The second floor basement of the tank hangar? I have to go all the way back there? Well, yeah. What's wrong with you, Otacon? Uh, nothing. Nothing. Uh, we can call Natasha and have more information, but we're backtracking. Sorry, uh, Meryl. We're gonna... We can't fight her now. We need to go back. Need to backtrack. I remember there's uh, uh, another space that we can crawl into and get more pills. Son of a bitch. Get out of here. Yeah, I'm not. Stop biting me. Okay, uh, we're gonna go back. I remember there was... There are more pills that we can get. Uh, let's go back. Let's, let's just backtrack real quick. And not waste time. We need to go all the way back. It's not far, but... I mean, it, it is far, but not that far. Also, uh, we need to go, you know, I'm going to pick up the camera while I'm at it. Hopefully we can find, uh, we can find, uh, C-Force. To go to the first floor. That'll take us to the nukes, uh... I believe this area, yep. Whoop! Whoops! If you walk on that and he's close, he's gonna hear the footsteps. But it doesn't matter, because we're going way back. Oh, we have C4. Two C4, uh, C4s, okay. That's, that's cool. We only need one. Where to get the camera, I think. Okay, so this is where we fought, this place is where we fought the tank. Uh, I need to throw one of these and have that, because it's filled with mines. I think we're past the... Uh, If we have, a, if we had a mine detector, we're probably gonna pick it up. But if we had a mine detector, we uh, we would see it on the radar. But we don't have uh, like to crawl like this. Lasers are gone. There used to be lasers here, but they're gone. We're going straight to the thing. Is it one or two? Ooh. Let's try one. I think it's two, B2. 
Yep, B2. But... Oh, I wanted to check out if there are, like, locked doors that I can get into. There's a level 6 door there, though, but we can't. I need to take out the soldiers, to be fair. You know, to be honest. So they don't annoy me while I'm running around. This guy goes back and forth. Thanks for the ration, but I don't need it. Okay, now that we got rid of him, let's, uh, yeah, there are lasers here. Ooh, this is, uh, dangerous <laughs> you need to see oh that's the PSG okay you got the PSG they're gonna tell you about the lasers I think let's pick it up you got a PSG one you can use that against sniper wolf hurry up and save Merrill shut up Campbell Just making sure there are no lasers. Okay, let's let's uh, let's blow up this wall real quick. All oh, right, traps. Did we check these? Didn't. Oh, yeah, we did. It's only a farm, uh, farmer's, uh, yep, let's go back. Gra grab the camera while we're at it. So let's go this way. door I want to see what level level four so we couldn't get it before okay so we got the camera what is that though it's fine Soldiers, lovely. I just killed them. We're not gonna bother. Yeah, if you get spotted like that and you don't want, you don't want that. You don't want to just go into another uh, location. Let it load and then go back. Because, ah, uh, man, I thought I could get to the elevator and ride it before they uh, notice me, but. I should have done this. 
Oh, right, I need that, right? Uh, let's go back. Let's go to B to B one. See what's there. This is level six. Yeah, there's nothing here, right? Oh wait, we we didn't go here. I think. Yeah. What a waste of time. I think the mine detector is, uh, I'm not sure, but maybe it's, no, that's the silencer and we already got it. But I missed the mine detector, but it, it doesn't matter. We don't need it. We don't need it at all. Uh, boom, boom, boom. I don't know what, yeah I don't know what uh which way they're facing and yeah, let's scroll we don't want the cameras to see us They will though, they will. No, they, no. Okay. I don't care about these ones, I'm just gonna run. I'm not gonna use uh, my last chaff grenade. I'll take a hit, cause you gotta rash them here. Let's go to B2 first. We need to go to B1, but I want to go to B2 first to do something real quick. We can use the gas mask here, but... I want to go into the lap. Stick a picture of that. If I remember correctly, because I might have forgot or remember in. Uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. But we'll take a picture of that, and just in case, we'll take a picture of the police knots. Because I really want to take a picture, uh, a picture of the uh, of of what's in here. 
I'm gonna show you later what it is. Now let's go back. And there's a trophy on that too, because I read the... Uh, I mean, you can take a picture of many places, but I don't know all the places. I just know this one, and I want to take a picture of that one, and you'll see why later. Bear with me, and uh, enjoy the ride. <laughs> Thank you. C4? No. Do you have any shaft grenade? We don't need it. Yeah, we can go and pick uh, pick the loot. Uh, there are a couple of loot, looty loot uh, that you can get, but we're going to B1, so we can go into the commander's uh, room, and then into the snow field. Snow into the snow, little snow. So we just backtracked just to get the PSG, but I wanted to get the camera too, since the door is level 4, and we have level 5, uh, card level 5, got it from Meryl. Where there's a there's another hole. I don't want that. Oh, there it is. Wait. Yes. Ooh, we need to pick up some things. No? That. That's what I wanted. I wanted the tears. It's fine. It's fine. We have a uh, have a lot of rat. Oh, we can use the. Yep. Now we can fight her. Okay. So what we're gonna do is. Okay. I want to equip that and equip that. Because. Snake is shaky. I can see you. Son of a bitch. Let me see where her laser is coming from. Okay, to the left a little bit. Sorry, Wolf, but it had to be done. Oh, I can, I can see her breathing. Do you see it? She got me before I can get her.
show up. I only have two bullets. Got her, boys. We got her. Where's Meryl? They took Meryl away, or did she die? Okay, so, uh, let's grab some stuff here. I want to go up here. See the blood? That's Wolf's blood. And also, there's a picture that I want to take here. Uh, I think this this way, maybe. I want to take a picture here. If I remember. Okay. Oh, no. I didn't want to do that. Or, if you take it this way. I'm just going to take two pictures because I'm not sure. It's been a long time. Yeah, we're going to take those pictures. And then, we're going to wrap up the episode since we defeated... Uh, defeated sniper wolf uh and uh yeah on the next episode we'll be continuing through to this level six door or are we so uh stay tuned for that and i'll catch you on the next episode peace <laughs>